As I've been promoting in emails about doing contests, we're getting ready four weeks from now, approximately, we will begin our contest season. And I want to encourage everybody to do it. So why should you do contests? Let me start by sharing my personal experience, and then I'll give you some reason why you should do this. The first time I did contests, this was back in 2014, okay, fall. I actually had more hair back then. You know, that was the very first time we could ever do contest. And you know the reason why I did the contest? One word, curiosity. That was it. I had, it was like, you can compete in contests and speaking? I said, well, that's kind of interesting. I was heavily involved in competitive sports all my life. And so I thought, well, this would be kind of a different thing if you do in a speech contest, you know? So I thought, let's try it. Now, now today, looking back over those years, why am I glad now, I mean, like, really glad that I did contest? First of all, there were things I never would have anticipated. I got to travel to places I'd never been before. Warsaw, Prague, Bratislava. So I got to travel all around in the contest. I met people from all over the world, because people from all over the world come to Europe to work. And some of them joined Toastmasters. So I got to meet them. I made some interesting connections, networking, that have actually helped me in my personal life, and, and let's say professional maybe a little bit. I met, uh, I made some good friends in doing these contests. So these are things I would have never expected at the beginning. Now as far as me being a speaker, I think I can really improve a lot as a speaker because of being in contests. No. The contests motivate you to work hard, much harder than you do for your, your speeches in the club. So that really helped a lot. Also, my level of nervousness was way down after doing lots of contests, and my confidence has gone way up. And the other thing that I would have never guessed is that when I started doing these contests, I come to realize that over time, I got to speak to and influence hundreds and hundreds and hundreds more people than I ever did in a club meeting with my speeches. So you get more opportunities in front of lots of people. There were contests in the beginning that I would be in front of over 300 people. Okay? So that's quite an intense situation. So those are very helpful. Whoops. Okay, now why should you guys do contests? Everything I said about myself, those are good reasons. But here's the main things to think about. Doing contests adds adventure to your Toastmaster journey. It's something a little unusual, a little different. And it's a good thing to experience. Doing this contest will offer you bigger challenges than you will ever experience doing the club meet on the speeches. And what, that, what happens when you have more bigger challenges? There's opportunities for what? More growth. So you can grow a lot from doing Toastmaster contests. So I strongly encourage you to experience the adventure of doing contests. If you do, if you do these contests, if you work at it, you are going to make yourself into a different person. You will change 